we can't let the, the heck is that? What? Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is NightShadowXO and today's video I'm going to be playing Fortnite Save the World and I'm going to be doing the quest line Tales of Beyond, one of the new ones they have for the military updates and military weapons are back too so that is a good thing and they have a new quest line for it too. So that's going to be pretty cool and I'm going to try to complete the whole quest page one if we it's possible to do all these in one video but here we go and let's do this guys and i can't wait commander Locke is off site and his sos beacon is active we need to find him before something happens i've made some missing posters everyone split up and spread the word so we're pretty much shooting posters okay, around Locke, town buddy, i know you're lost yes thank you pop and scared and sobbing inconsolably. Are you trying to make me feel guilty? Maybe. <laughs> Do you consider that part of your job? You're doing well, and I'll make a note of that at review time. Review time. Wow. We've got an APB on a fugitive from snack time. The suspect appears to be a bot male, age 7, 12 inches tall, and is a known optimist. May or may not be equipped with a rich, sonorous voice. If you encounter this individual, contact home base immediately. Or just like, pick him up and bring him home. He's probably all tuckered out. <laughs> okay. Roger that. We got ourselves a Fender Tech seismological welding unit stranded behind enemy lines. I suggest you kiss your loved ones goodbye and make your peace with your creator. Why? Hey, Private Jeffords, I suppose you should use that time to listen to a good science-based podcast about stars. Point is, few, if any of us, will make it through this mission alive. Wait, what? Why? I was given five minutes to draw up a plan of attack. You can have the amount of time it takes to come up with a plan that doesn't kill everyone. But everyone's already off kissing their loved ones. That was awesome! Don't kill them! Yeah, don't kill them. I get it. Go, go, go. Now, there we you go. Know what's good for you. Hey, Jess. I agree with the content of what you're saying, but maybe not the tone. I like the tone. Floated. <laughs> She's like, I like Floating the tone. Atlas. There we go. Hey, Lachan, if you ran away, that's all right. You can come home at any time. No one's going to be mad, okay? I will. We're risking human lives to find a thing. And now that I think of it, what kind of psychopath would create a child robot for a war zone? Dr. Venderman was a genius. But, yeah, building a child robot for the apocalypse was a weird, possibly cruel move. He's a not child a child robot. robot. He's a learning AI. He is? Yes, don't you listen to him? I'm the one who buys him voice packs, so yeah. It's just, he says so many words. And sometimes, just the same word. One day he just said the word great. Just, all day. He's finding his way in the world. That's no easy task these days. He just needs love. Pop, if you're listening, this is some A-level making me feel guilty. You might want to take notes. We can't let the, the heck is that? The Head to the <laughs> what? <laughs> Whoa. That's a new zombie. That is insane. I have never seen a zombie like that before. It kind of looks like unfinished, kind of. That's what it looks like. It looks like a kaiju. <laughs> is there gonna be kaijus? This is how. Is this the sequel of a uh, Pacific Rim? Oh, there it is! Thank goodness, we're able to complete the this page I think the one are quest we one. Block is nearby. <clears throat> Ray? Did you find Locke? Hello, Major. The home base defense department regrets to inform you that we have found your bot. That's great news! Why are you being so stiff? Informal? Lock was found unresponsive. What? Possibly face down, but it is hard to tell. In a puddle. He's been rushed to Blackwell Memorial, but it doesn't look good. I'm sorry. What? You should come see him as soon as you can. Commander, can you um, can you take over, please? We've got it covered. Go see Lock. Let's keep the train moving. Now's not the time to give up. So he's he died. <laughs> No! 
This can't be possible. He must be, be revived, Ray. Revive it, Ray. Level five loot. Oh yeah. Oh my God. What mission was that? I need Let's that in my life. Sorry, Ray. We just assumed the robot doctors were robotic doctors for robots. So when they all agreed that he was going to die, we were like, you're the robot doctors. But now we know the robot doctors are people doctors made out of robot. All that matters is that he's going to be okay. Eventually. So collect security footage in suburbs. Okay. Imagine if you can, a waterlogged bot lost in the strange ether that separates the living from the dead. As he clings to life, his guilt-stricken friends, desperate to place blame on anyone but themselves, call for an investigation into the night where everything went wrong. As they search the zone for CCTV surveillance footage, they find more than they bargained for. What the heck is going on? This is a pretty cool storyline, though. We need to find out how Locke was locked out. Not because I'm feeling crippling waves of guilt and I'm desperate to shift blame. Just, you know, an official post-crisis post-mortem. Like we always do. Okay, Let's Ray. Check this tape. I, I collected it. It's there goes Locke. He's got an easel? He's painting a watercolor of the sunset? Come on! Is that a tiny beret? We do not deserve that bot. There's me. I'm going right past him and locking up for the night because I'm wearing an eye patch over my only eye. Yar! Ravier the booby locking this door, me hearties. Oh my you god. really committed to that bit. Yes. Yes, I did. <laughs> it's like, it's like part of the last event from the Yar event. Take out the enemies to clear the encampment. Yeah, I know. Let's go with the storyline. Come on. Do it. One down. Let's find the next I one. know. Get on with the story. The encampment might be stronger. Come Make on. Sure weapons and ammo I know, are ready to go. Ray. Come on. Oh, no. He's knocking on the door. Hey, it's Luna. She's going to the intercom. Go away. We don't want you here. I thought it was a husk. It's usually husks. Ooh, he did not take that well. Oh, he's gonna. Oh, honey, no, don't. Oh, he threw away his tiny painting. No loss. Oh, come on, what is wrong with you? No loss. The pedestrian landscape phase of his is stunting his artistic development, and you know it. He's like, no loss. She's like, how could you There's say Locke. that? Hey, look, it's me. Locke's waving you over. Did you bring him back to home base? Uh, well. Maybe. Give the boy a firm handshake. Put her there. And some fatherly advice. <laughs> like hell, boy. I'm testing grenades. <laughs> oh, grenade. oh! Dude. What? It's good advice. I'm testing out grenades, boy. You better That's run. One. Take it down. Grenade. He's like, ah. Oh. <laughs> Here we go. Looks Love like it. he sees someone in the distance. That's me. Looks like he recognized it's you, and now he's running away. He's developed a healthy fear of me. Why has he developed a healthy fear of you? Because he's a smart little robot. He's a smart little Take robot because he has a healthy fear of her. Wow. Two down. Let's find the next one. What is wrong with this game? The encampments are getting stronger. Make oh, sure you're completed prepared. already. Wow. JJ boys, JJ. Oh, no. He's going for the trebuchet. Dennis, you decommissioned the trebuchet like we talked about, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, I definitely decommissioned something, and I'm sure we'll find out what soon enough. Okay, I think I've seen everything I need to see. Take a good long look at what you've done. Done what? Seabot. The results of the post-mortem are in. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Sure. Mm-hmm. What? What? Mm -hmm. What's going on? Mm -hmm. We're failures. All of us. I've never been a failure in my life, and I'm not starting today. We're all gonna take turns nursing that bot back to health, starting with me. Oh! 
Starting with Ray. <laughs> okay, good plan. Bye now. Okay, summer tickets. So that's pretty cool. Mission alert rewards. Okay. And uh, that's from the, the quest. If you dare, a small bot emerging from a world of nightmares. A perfect reproduction of a monster unknown to this world. Forever etched into his imagination. He knows he must warn his friends and loved ones. But when he tries to speak, he finds he can only scream. This installment of Locke's Book of Monsters is brought to you by War Games. The fun new combat simulator available in your Storm Shield now. We now return to Locke's Tales wow. of Beyond. I swear to God, this, this game is so silly. It really is. Okay, on to the next mission. Heck? Can you turn that down? Uh, Maybe add a little pitch correct while you're at it. Uh, Luck, <laughs> buddy. I can't help you unless you tell me what's wrong. Uh, okay, gosh. you're scared. We'll go look for scary things. And you can tell me when we find what's scaring you. Okay. Maybe it's the, the new monster? How about this guy? Pretty scary, right? Is that what you saw? You think this is scary? I mean, I don't know. The endless parade of horrors kind of threw off my barometer. What I saw was really, really scary. What was it? What about this guy? I like him. He's got a great attitude. So, not him? No, my monster's different. Can I have any more information? Uh, well, let's see. In his presence, I lived a thousand lives and died a thousand deaths. To what? speak his name is to drink in the sloshy water of insanity. And I'm pretty sure it was purple. So not this guy. Different guy. So he is the husk. Okay, he did see the monster. Eh? Nightmarish? Ooh. He doesn't go, ooh. He goes, ooh. Uh. Okay, let's keep looking then. <laughs> so, this uh, monster of yours, was he like something you've seen in a movie? No, he was an original monster. Well, for what it's worth, I'm glad he's not a reboot. If we have to have monsters, let's keep things fresh, am I right? True. Are you talking about that monster? <laughs> He's dead now. I slayed the monster for you, no. buddy. If you have to ask, it's not the monster. When you find him, your heart will drown. So, probably not a gargoyle. Would a gargoyle fill your soul with puddle water and make you slosh forevermore? Lock, buddy, can I give you a little shake? Okay. I see what's happening here. Let's get him back to base, Commander. So he's full of water, and that's probably messing up his uh, component and something. But I obviously see the monster too, so is it actually his fault? Locked in here, so but here we go. It's amazing he hasn't completely shorted out. He needs emergency intervention. You're in luck. Bot Dr. Dennis is scrubbed in and ready to operate. Dennis, no offense, but I don't think you're qualified to perform open bot surgery. I've dropped my phone in four separate toilets and one fountain. So trust me, I know what I'm doing. Prep the patient and bring me rice. <laughs> Not the old rice trick. Ah, uh, some gold. Consider if you're allowed. A bot in need of life-saving water reduction surgery. With no surgeon to be found, he turns to his best and only hope an amateur whose only previous patient was a phone he dropped in a toilet four separate times we now return you to Locke's tales of beyond <laughs> i really like this story it's a, it's quite quite amusing really amusing to, to do i'll see you guys in the game
Okay, guys, we're here now, and we gotta hunt down some oven parts. So we gotta go in these houses and destroy them. But I'm, I'm pretty sure it allows so us to uh, get more. Elements for Dennis. We all know this is a stupid idea, right? Until we come up with a better idea, this is our only idea. Something weird has been happening in this zone. Oh, the furnaces too. That's good. And spawning huge waves of enemies. I love how it gives us parts every time he breaks something. That's good. When you find an Ray, are you sure you want to put lock in the oven? No, I am not. Four toilets, Ray. Stop being proud of that. It's about never giving up. And washing your hands really, really well, right? Yeah, sure, whatever. These come as ovens. Come on, game. Found some more heating elements. Keep them coming. We need to build the perfect oven. This time's for real. Even heat, no hot spots. And a working oven light so he can read. He's gonna be in there for a while. If we're doing this, it's now or never. Make okay, the Dennis. <laughs> okay, wheel in the patient. Screwdriver. Screwdriver. Basmati. Starting Basmati infusion. Don't say he died. The rice isn't going to cut it. We're gonna need that oven. Stat. Okay, he's not dead. Okay, That's good. How's our patient doing? He's rejecting the rice transplant. What does that mean? Rice Traditionally, transplant. Traditionally, there would be nothing we could do. However, there is an experimental treatment I just thought of. But it's important we temper our expectations. I'm not a miracle worker. I'm just a man who cannot afford a new phone. Prep the quinoa. Quinoa? Quinoa has never made anything better! Couscous is too round, amaranth is too pretentious, and Orzo doesn't even know what it wants to be! If you want a dry lockout, Quinoa is our last hope. Which quinoa? I don't know what that is. Dormant encampments may become active. Is that a real thing or is that just made up by Dennis? But it's in, in the Save the World universe. Once we start the infusion, there's no going back. Okay, we of his life, he'll be walking oh, around with Dennis. tiny bits of quinoa in his circuitry. Do we have any other option? No. Unless we're including non-food-based solutions, in which case Probably. Before we start the experimental treatment, does anyone have a better idea for drawing lockout? Anyone at all. Just has to be better than quinoa. We're setting that bar real low. I'm sorry, Ray. Flamethrower? Refocusing our energies on saving people? <sighs> I guess we'll have the quinoa. Excellent choice. I'll put that order right in for you. It's done. Now? We wait. He won't be able to respond, but he can hear you. I'll give you some privacy. If there's anything you want to say to him, you should say it now. Is he gonna be okay? It's out of our hands. Buck, I'm so sorry we let you down. You deserve so much more. And so much better than what we gave you and- Sorry, forgot a step. Gotta shake that quinoa. Don't let me interrupt. Just pretend I'm not here. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm gonna be all Ooh. better. We'll keep it low and slow, and in a couple days, you'll be good as new. A couple of days? I don't want to be all alone in an oven for a couple of days. You won't be alone. We'll be taking shifts to keep you company. It'll be like a slumber party. A dinosaur-themed slumber party. Oh. Your favorite. It'll be fun, I promise. You promise, promise? I promise, promise. Aw, so scared. Sure. If that's your thing, a man on a path to madness, a highly decorated soldier in possession of a keen military mind and a warrior's resolve, sworn to protect an ovenbot with a terrible secret and a thousand questions. We now return you to Locks. Tales of Beyond. So cool.
But this is, uh, I completed quest page one with you guys, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this storyline, and I'm going to be continuing it until I'm pretty much done with all of them. But uh, thank you so much for watching. If you guys want to support the video, you pretty much just did if you're watching to the end. That's watch time for me. If you guys want to support more, just hit the like button, subscribe, and all that kind of stuff. Comment down below if you guys want to. But uh, catch you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Catch you guys later. And goodbye.